Hello, I'm doing a proper intro real quick just to explain a couple of things. One, hair day, just got out of the shower. Ignore it. Two, hi, my name is Jasmine. I run the crochet right here on YouTube. And I'm a crochet person, but today I'm setting up something for me to be crocheting, which I'll explain more and you'll see more. But <laughs> basically, my friend got me a sleeping mask to do blindfolded videos, like pick picking like yarn at random. And I have an entire bin of sweet snuggles. I'm not going to show you all of it right now because that's the entire point of the rest of this video. But I did find a couple other balls and I was making this its own video, so I just wanted to explain a couple things that would be loose ends. <laughs> One, I reference me cleaning for a room makeover video, and I suggest going to watch that. <sighs> I can't do that yet because the furniture that I ordered to complete my room makeover did not get here on time that it was supposed to. It was supposed to be here today, but it's not going to get here until sometime between tomorrow, which for me, I'm filming this on Thursday, so it's yet coming sometime Friday or sometime Saturday. And the Friday just like rain just too close of a call for me not being able to post a video for you guys and I didn't have anything else pre-film because all of the video ideas I do have would require a full days of time and I've been doing the room makeover so obviously that doesn't work but just explaining that little detail that video is not out yet it's coming out after this one maybe next week I'm not sure it's basically me going through and cleaning like my low-key hoarder styled room, trying to get rid of a bunch of stuff, get rid of all the junk I have, and cleaning in a way that is functional for me. <laughs> so this was just a little chunk of me organizing the yarn, was coming up with the Sweet Snuggles bin. It's all size 7 yarn. It, I have one with a label right here, so <laughs> this is what it pretty much looks like. But there are different variations of sizes, which you'll obviously see. But like I said, I found a few more whilst I was cleaning. So I'm just going to add those into the bin, and then the video will cut, and it will be me explaining it all over again. My bad. Like I said, didn't realize I would need to put another intro on it, so to speak. But I found this cream-colored one, a yellow one a like red vergated one, a teal, a light brown ball, a red and black very tangled ball, and a very vibrant lime green ball. But I'm gonna leave it there just because I wanted to catch you up on the couple balls that I did have. I will be doing this soon sometime next month. I'll probably post the first episode of me randomly picking a yarn out of here. I'm trying to lift up my voice because someone's being very loud with their app in the hallway and I apologize for that if you can hear it. But that's all I have for future Jasmine. Now you can have past Jasmine or the rest of the video. Okay, I think this is the best angle that I'm going to manage to get. So I'm just going to lock it in. But hi, my name is Jasmine. I run The Crocheter here on YouTube and I'm doing something a little bit unusual. I don't know if this is going to be like the intro to a video or just like an actual video that is like an intro, like how you uh, like um, TV shows have like pilot episodes. This might be like a pilot video on my series, but I'm currently in the process of working on my like room makeover. So if you haven't seen that video yet, it's probably up by now. I would go check it out because there was a lot of cleaning in the process. It's I think it's currently like 9:30. I've been up since 7:30. I had breakfast and then I've been cleaning. I've got four. <laughs> Yarn bins cleaned out, organized a bit more, and put away, awaiting my new bed's arrival. But my friend bought me a little sleep mask, but she intended on it being a blindfold for some videos. And I have this bin here, which has a hole in it. As you can tell, there's a little hole right here. So we're going to ignore the little hole. But it is a mesh bag, so I figured she bought me a blindfold to blindly pick yarn. And in this bin, at least you guys could see all the way through what yarn's in there, what I'm feeling, what I'm doing, even though I won't be able to see. And what yarn am I going to fill in here to make mystery videos with? Well, that would be my insanely and unreasonable Sweet Snuggles collection because there is a probably pound of yarn over here and a pound of yarn in this garbage bag right here. That's why it's next to me. 
but I also have a bunch of these tiny random balls in like varying different sizes of how much is in the ball. So I feel like it'll be a little bit fun because for instance, like here's a little yellow ball, here's a little purple ball, here's a little pink ball, you get the gist. So it'll be a little bit fun because they all have the same feeling minus the yarn bee one that I have and the cozy tethered one that I got around Christmas time. They're really the only two that have like a different feeling to them, but they're going to go in here anyways. And I'm kind of just going to like throw them in here like a little bit randomly, but so far that's three balls. This is number four, five six it's a lot of them here's number seven let's grab some from out of here now this one's the same color so i won't do that one seven here's number eight going in you can see i'm just lining it, the bottom of it from where i'm looking uh, i think this one's nine i've already lost count of how many of these i have and it's because i usually use them up immediately but i haven't used them and quite a bit because December I did my yarn advent calendar so I didn't get a chance to use them at all during it then and during market season I didn't really use them anyways and market season's a good few months but I didn't do it and then I didn't do it December either so hopefully July not July this is June <laughs> hopefully January on I can try and tackle out some of these yarns I'm kind of just throwing them in <laughs> randomly like I'm not gonna remember where I put anything anyways so there's really no rhyme or reason to what I'm doing do I have any ideas of what I'm gonna use the yarn for once I actually eventually do pull it out no but I feel like at least this way th look at this one this one she's all messed up this way you guys can just see the little colors that I've got out and I'm putting in here, like, look at this yellow. Like, I have a new yellow right here, and it's just, it's in dire need of being picked. <laughs> but I don't really, like, reach for them that much currently, so hopefully this is a fun way that I can, like, get back into them. Here's a very teeny tiny ball of white. <laughs> here is a abnormally small little ball of blue left over from Yarn Mist. I still have this yarn left over from Yarn Mist, as well as the orange yarn left over from Yarn Mist. I've got this random blue color, which I don't even know where I got it from because it's not like the exact same as Chanel's, so I really don't know where that came from. Was that all of them in here? It was just the top of this garbage bag? Aw, oh, that means I'm gonna have a lot more yarn to put away later. Oh no. Well, that's more yarn for me to deal with in a couple seconds. It just means that there's going to be a lot of light blue in here, so I'm going to kind of smudge this one under here. So they're a little bit more sparred out. And the reason I have so much of this like light blue and this like brownish color is because I was using these to make jumbo sized Pokemon. Which I don't have any out to show you unfortunately, but I should have some posted on my Instagram if you want to check that out. It's at the Crochettery. It's the same handle as it is here on YouTube. As well as I'll have some posted on my Etsy store eventually at some point for made to orders. So you can check out the crochetery on there as well. It'll be the same username. But that is why I have so many of these too. And it looks like I've just barely filled this bin perfectly to the brim with yarn. So I'm just going to pull this over and lift it up even though I'm a little weak. So that's what it looks like from one side, from the other side, from the other side, and from the last side. Now the bottom is not mesh, so you can't see from the mesh, but that's what the top looks like. So this is now complete. This is a giant um, mesh laundry bin I got from Walmart, by the way. This one is, I believe, a little under eight dollars like seven dollars and something cents and there is a smaller white version but it doesn't have the closed top because this closes but it does have the same handles but it's white and it's like half the size of this one to be honest but in my experience of using it it carries two complete like full full loads of laundry and it's only like three dollars and like 80 90 something cents 
So it's still a pretty good steal. <laughs> but let me scoot in closer for the outro. Oh, <laughs> a little too close. Okay, my face got cut off. But that is all for this. I think I'm just going to leave it like this and I'm going to leave it like in my room for now. But this is a lot of yarn. <laughs> I have a lot more yarn still to go through and clean. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bags more to go of yarn still. And I'm like four or five down. So I have a lot of yarn, which is not surprising. But like I said, currently I'm in the process of cleaning my room before my bed gets here. Because I had to buy a new one, which is in the room makeover video, which is awful because I'm only staring at the before still and it's still pretty bad. Uh, <laughs> but I do have a lot more yarn available that I wanted to use for other videos, so I'm excited for that. I'm prepping for a few other videos. Not sure in which the order will come out compared to this one, so I don't want to get into them in case it's either been out or hasn't come out yet. But, as always, if you have any ideas, or if you want to see the future of me making some of these, and you have a couple ideas, so let's say you saw the blue and you think you should do a whale, even if in the next episode of this I don't pull the blue, let's say I pull the brown, I'd still make a whale, just because someone recommended it to me in the forever comment section. So this is kind of just like a little intro video, it's just quick, small, but that's all for the actual packaging. I'm going to go because I've got more cleaning to do, but I'll see you guys next time.